Hazmat is an acronym that means hazardous materials. For our Hazmat Week this year, our theme is Hazmat is a habit, not an act. Do it right all the time. What we look forward to throughout this week is that it will change the culture of hazmat across the institution and that staff will understand we don't only put emphasis on hazmat just because we have an audit coming up or an inspection, but it is our way of life, what we do every single day. Our objective is to raise our level of awareness and improve our culture of safety around hazmat. What we're looking forward to in this week is that we'll engage staff get to have discussions, interviews, pop quizzes, understand do they know why we do ABCD, why we need to ensure hazmat safety is important, as well as getting feedback and having uh, ideas from them, how can we implement hazmat better within the institution. To bring your understanding of hazmat closer home, I can mention a few items that we use within our households that are considered to be hazardous. A good example is cleaning detergents, such as bleach or what we use to clean our bathrooms. An example in the kitchen is the LPG gas that we use for cooking. It's flammable and unexplosive. At the workplace, specifically here at Aga Khan University Hospital, we have different types of hazardous materials and waste. A good example is the chemicals that we use for cleaning, for doing different lab analysis and procedures, high-level disinfectants, syringes that we use to administer drugs to patients, and the air fresheners that we use in our washrooms. For us to ensure that we are safe, we need to follow proper handling procedures, both in our homes and at the workplace. 